the wrong last time? Last time I said. <laughs> yeah. I'm We're at the track for oh. our pre race oh. shakeout. I thought it was oh. a picture. <laughs> Where are you going? Nina's running the eight. Walker in the 15, yep. Corey in the 5K, Morgan, 5K runner, Victoria, 15, Steeple! Try to see a Fresno State. Here we are! Room tour! Where's the lights? Oh, Hello, New York! view of the freeway! San Diego, roomies. Your girls are roommates. Time for a room tour. Hi, MTV. Welcome to my crib. Today we are in sunny San Diego. This is G's bed. Nice and plump. Minus plump too. <laughs> Hello, New York. Woo! We have the freeway. Um, honestly, not a bad view because we could have got that way, and yes. I think the dumpster is that way. Now we have the bathroom. It's a four, five, six inch size bathroom. Sheesh. And we have complimentary housekeeping. <laughs> <laughs> and a good size bathroom. What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. We are in sunny San Diego for a meet tomorrow. Um, I'm going to take you guys along this evening, our pre-race dinner and shopping. And then tomorrow is race day and I'm running steeple. And I'm so excited to bring you guys along. Heading down to dinner. Four. Actually, no, that's a good thing. You might not want that in your vlog. We're starting our hike to dinner. Pretty much everything is like a half mile away. So we're gonna walk across the freeway at the light, and then we'll get to all of our options. Enroll G in this children's academy. Yeah, really good track program. Loser. <laughs> G and I are on our first date together. You're One really event. so dark. All I see is the fire behind you. Does this help? <laughs> no, it's not even on. You didn't even put your flashlight on. Oh, were you just brightening it? I think it's when they play better. Yes. What's up guys? We are back home now to our hotel room and we had a crazy night trying to find dinner. So we met at 6.45 to go out and find dinner. First, we have to like cross a freeway because our hotel's on the other side. It's like a half mile walk to get anywhere. We started walking, got to Lazy Dog. They said hour and a half wait for your seven people party because we went as a team. So then we were like, let's call BJ's and we started walking to BJ's, which was like another 15 minute walk call them two hour wait. And we're like, are you kidding me? So then apparently according to Google Maps, Kava was around. So we were gonna walk like 10 minutes over to Kava. We get to that spot and there's nothing there. Like literally so misleading, there was no Kava. Um, so then we're like, okay, what are we gonna do? And at that point, everyone is so hangry. It's after seven o'clock. We had lunch at 11 o'clock on our seven hour trip down to San Diego. And so everyone was kind of like starting to figure out their own plan. So Mena ordered us an Uber. We Ubered over to Cheesecake Factory, had a very nice dinner for two. When we got there, they sat us immediately since we were willing to sit outside. And then unfortunately, all the shops closed at eight and we finished dinner at 8.30. So we're like looking at like, oh my gosh, there's literally Urban Outfitters, Zara, like Gucci, all Dior, our favorite stores. Prada, like all of the like name brand like stores that we were just gonna go window shopping because we don't have the money to spend there, and all of the fun stores that we could actually buy clothes at, like Free People and literally any cool store, it was there. But they all closed at eight, and it was eight thirty. So then we were like, well, just gonna walk through, and Aloe was open, and I've never been to Aloe. I've seen it all over, and I've always wanted to go. And they ended up closing at 9. So we had like 15 minutes in there. And we both found some trucker hats. I got the all black one. She got the all white one. And so we were super content because we got our piece of clothing. Um, 
or accessory for the night and now we're back home so we have to get ready for tomorrow's race and we'll see you then also this vlog has been very sporadic because we slept for like half of the trip down here and we had a three hour drive then lunch and then another four hour drive and then a shakeout run so i have no idea what i've actually filmed like i think i filmed shopping but not dinner or something so sorry for the chaos today but tomorrow will be better i'm running steeple at 11 a.m and i leave the hotel at 9 a.m so i'll bring you guys along for race day tomorrow good morning y'all it is race day i'm heading down to breakfast i brought some oatmeal so i can heat up that and then we'll see what else they have but 7 a.m so i'm going to get breakfast and then i leave at 9 a.m this morning breakfast time I am back from breakfast now, so I'm going to start doing my hair and makeup. I'll do my makeup first, but now it's time to start getting ready. I have like an hour and a half, so I can take my time and just enjoy a slow morning. Just films a get ready with me on TikTok, so if you don't, you know the drill. Go follow me on Instagram and TikTok, G underscore Chermonti, and watch the get ready with me. I'm done with my race day makeup, and now it's time for some race day hair. Also, no surprise here, I am vlogging today, so if you don't already, go subscribe to my YouTube channel to see all of the race day content. Race day hair is done. I have a slick back ponytail with a bubble braid, and I have a green ribbon at the top and the bottom for this race, and I'm ready to put my uniform on. The uniform top and bundies are on. We're going with the all reds today, and I'm ready to roll. We are wearing our gray and white warm-up suit for the day and the reason why I've been getting ready in the bathroom the whole morning is because Minna doesn't race until 3 so she's not getting up until 9 and I'm leaving at 9. So she gets to sleep in today and I don't want to really bug her with any of the lights on or anything so I've just been in my little box in the bathroom getting ready so she can enjoy her beauty sleep. These are by far my favorite warm-ups. I'm obsessed and I'm all packed up. You just close all the bags up. Here's all my tech stuff, all of my bags. Almost time to go. Hey. Anna's up and she walked me downstairs for my race. I'm leaving on the first van. Are you ready? Yeah. <laughs> no one was at my meet to film my steeple race, but here's the water pit that beat me. Acai bowls at Shake Smart, which is a San Diego special. We always come to Starbucks after our race. San Diego State's track is literally on top of the parking garage. It's like up there, second story, and below it is parked cars. Mena is running the 800, but they're 20 minutes behind, so she's sitting here wasting time. <laughs> It's like 5 o'clock, the meet is like 45 minutes behind, so we're going to get home at like 1 or 2 a.m. But right now I'm taking a nap on Walker's butt. <laughs> Makes a great pillow. And just waiting for Corey and Morgan to run the 5k tonight. Track meets look a lot like <laughs> Walker. <laughs> I thought you were shaking your butt. <laughs> track meets look a lot like running to the track to watch your teammates then napping back at camp and doing that on repeat. We had a long trip home after the meet and didn't make it back until 1am. Thanks for watching, we'll see you next vlog.